Nadia and Shupei. So it's day one of callbacks. It's a big day. Lots of great girls today. The first five are backstage and ready to go. Well, I'm the first one today, yeah. so I'm very freaking excited. Yeah. One more time, one more time, one more time. Ready? Okay. Hi there, guys. I mean, I think for every model, the Victoria's Secret Fest show is one of the biggest things you can book. It's just everything about it, it's something I can't describe. And of course, for your career, it's really good to you. Like, it's Victoria's Secret. How are you? You're here! I know. <laughs> you look really great. You look, you look great. You, look you do. Good. What do you do for a workout? I'm a model. <laughs> like every girl here has yeah. put in so much work just to be here. And to get the casting in general, it's like a really big feat. So we're all just like really grateful to be here. I practice and I will walk for you. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. What's happening? What's happening? What's happening? I'm just, just I don't know. It's my first time, so I don't know what to do when I'm like. You don't look nervous. You just look excited. I'm so excited to be standing in front of you. You have no idea. Just take it easy and have fun. Of course, like yeah. it's an important like casting, but you really want to enjoy it because it's only once in a year, so you really want to give the best. Where are you from, Paulina? I'm from Poland. Poland. Jak se máš? Ja, dziękuję bardzo dobrze. All right, let's go. This is awesome. Go back and establish your walk, and then just come to us because you came running out, All right. and you didn't, you didn't give yourself a chance. So. Relax. Yeah, yeah. yeah sure. Yeah. It's kind of nice to almost have other people in the same situation as you because you can relate to them and talk to them and before you go out and they can give you tips and you can give them the tips that you found helpful. And uh, my biggest motivation uh, is you guys because I work very hard to be here and this is my biggest dream, so. No, you look great. Thank you look so really much. great. No, thank you so much. It's my least favorite part of the casting process when I have to break it to the models that worked so hard and didn't get cast and also explain that just because you didn't get it this year doesn't mean you're never going to get booked for the show. You know, we've had models who have tried out for years and then finally just something changed, something clicked, or they just happened to have the right look for that year. I came to this casting before um, two times. The first time was a success okay. and the second time was not, but that doesn't mean that I gave up. I think that was great for me, actually, to get a no, so I got really ready mentally and physically, and this time I just looked in front of me and it just worked and it really felt good. I understand that Victoria's Secret is looking for a girl that's really confident in herself. At first I was shocked, so I was like, why or do they want me? I don't look like your typical Victoria's Secret model. But, you know, they took me in with open arms and all the girls were really welcoming, so I feel good my own skin, the way I look, the way I am. Hi. I don't think I can follow that. You can. I auditioned last year and I made it to the show in Paris. I'm walking the runway, it was, it was magical. It's like falling in love for the first time. You can't explain it, you just know it's great. <laughs> so fingers crossed for this year. It would mean everything because I've been working with this brand for three years. Like, I shoot for them all the time. I would love, love, love to walk the show. I've done my best. I worked out really hard, and I walked in there, and I feel like I had a good energy, and like now I can just go home and wait and see if it worked out or not. It's very emotional. It is for all of us. You're our last one! Yeah. Good, Good way to end. Good way to end. Yeah. We have more girls this year that we absolutely love than we have ever had before. We have such a rigorous elimination process. You have to tick all the boxes with no compromises. So there's technically six spots open there and one here. Only six. You could do the entire know. show with the second board and be deliriously happy. She's not an obvious beauty, which we're not about obvious. Cute in pink. She's got that cute smile. Oh, she's, I've never seen a bad picture of her, ever. She's someone that belongs in our forever land. So we still need one more girl in pink, mm -hmm. and there are three open spots in VS. Which one walks, she walks. better? They, bo they both walk well. 
have done it. Yep. Wow, Look at I'm that. happy. It's a full board. That's a really good board. I mean, it was very emotional. Every girl earned it. Every, Every girl, girl earned deserving. it. Wow. I mean, really, guys, this is our best lineup ever. I cannot wait to tell them. I've got a question for you. Sure. Would you like to do the show this year? <laughs> Are you serious? Yes, I'm totally serious. <laughs> Say yes. Oh, my God. You made the show. It would be a dream come true. The dream came true. You're in the show. No. Yes. No. Yes. Guys, yes. No. <laughs> We're at the Mercedes-Benz Arena in Shanghai. And we are planning the Victoria's Secret Fashion Show for 2017. Could we have three runways that rise and fall through the show? I'm just thinking, are we getting away from what we actually are trying to grab out of the TV show? It's a puzzle at this point. We still don't know.